Hey, my name is Aiden Carcano. And I'm Makaya Murphy. And you're, and you're watching, watching the Bearcat, Bearcat News Network. Network. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now, for the Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state under God, one and indivisible. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. This Feel Good Friday, meet Jean Jing the Penguin. This is a story about Jing Jing, the South American Magellanic Penguin that swims 5,000 miles each year to be reunited with the man who saved his life. The penguin was saved by Joao Pereira de Souza, a 70-year-old part-time fisherman who lives in an island village just outside Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. Joao found the tiny penguin at his local beach lying on rocks. It was covered in oil, could barely move, and was close to death. He cleaned the oil off the penguin's feathers and fed him a daily diet of fish to build his strength. He named the penguin Jinjin. Jin. After a week, Joao took the penguin in a boat to a nearby island and released the animal. Later that day, Joao heard squawking in his backyard, and much to his surprise, he saw the penguin had returned and was calling out for him. Jing Jing stayed with Joao another 11 months, and then just after he changed his coat with new feathers, he disappeared. It is unknown where Jing Jing had ventured off to. Months later, Joao heard a loud squawk coming from his backyard, and Jing Jing was there waiting for him, and the two were reunited again. This has been going on every year since. It is unclear where the penguin goes after he leaves. Some have speculated he spends the rest of the time breeding off the coast of Argentina and Chile, traveling up to 5,000 miles in a round trip from breeding locations and then back to Sea Joao. Truth is, nobody really knows where he goes. But what is clear is, Every year he goes away, and every year he comes back to be reunited with the man who saved his life. Joao says, I love this penguin, like it's my own child, and I believe the penguin loves me. No one else is allowed to touch him, he pecks them if they do. He lies on my lap, lets me give him showers, allows me to feed him sardines, and to pick him up. Everyone said he wouldn't return, but he has been coming back to visit me every year. He arrives in June and leaves to go home in February, and every year he becomes more affectionate as he appears even happier to see me. It's thought Jing Jing believes the fisherman is also a penguin. When he sees him, he wags his tail like a dog and honks with delight. Penguins are usually very loyal to their partner. And to Jing Jing, Mr. Zhao is now like family to him. Anyway, that's the end of this video. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye bye. Parents, it's that time of year again. You know how you always ask your kid how their day was, or what happened at school today, and they always mumble something like, it was fine or okay, I guess. Well, now you can really see what happened at school with all the memories captured in the 2022-2023 school year at Central Middle School. This year's yearbook, Diary of a CMS Bearcat, is only $40, and can be purchased at Justin's Yearbook Avenue through this link, or you can use your phone and scan the QR code.
If you are an incoming Ball High boys or girls freshman and you are interested in playing water polo for Ball High, there will be an informational meeting for you and your parents on May 18th at 3.30 p.m. in room 217. Free physicals will be offered on Saturday, April 22nd and Saturday, May 6th at Ball High. This will cover you for the 2023-2024 school year. If you plan to play any sport, dance, or cheer take advantage of this free opportunity. You must have a new physical each school year in order to participate. Here is today's riddle. Here is what happened today in history. May 5th, 1961. Alan Shepard becomes America's first space traveler, blasting off from Cape Canaveral, Florida. Three, two, one, zero. Ignition. Shepard makes a 15-minute suborbital flight on board his Mercury capsule, dubbed Freedom 7. 1821. France's former ruler, Napoleon Bonaparte, whose armies once swept across Europe, dies in exile on the South Atlantic island of St. Helena. 1818. Karl Marx, the philosopher whose ideas bore fruit in communist regimes worldwide during the 20th century, is born in what's now Germany. 1981, Irish Republican Army member Bobby Sands dies at Northern Ireland's Mays Prison during the 66th day of his hunger strike. And 1891. Composer Peter Ilyich Tchaikovsky conducts at the opening concert at Carnegie Hall, then known as Music Hall, in New York City. Today in History, May 5th. Camille Bohan and the Associated Press. And that is your Bearcat News for today.